Kids, it's Emma here. Today I'm going to be giving you tips on how to organize your room. So, the purpose of this video is I'm going to be giving you some tips and how to organize your room by like whatever you have, like makeup, say you have clothes to hang, where you should put your clothes. So I'm going to be showing you how to keep your room clean. So let's go. So the first thing I do before I start cleaning like the floor and everything, I make my bed because in the mornings I wake up and I'm crazy and like I just throw my covers everywhere. So I'm going to be clean, um, organizing my bed. Because I have a lot of stuffed animals over here and everything, so yeah, I'm gonna clean that. And so whatever's on my bed, I just put aside and I'll clean that later. Like if I have food wrappers for me, if I didn't feel good in the morning, I just throw them in the trash can. So honestly, I just make my bed. And then I put my pillows on, and I fold my blankets. And then I always have to move my um, stuffed animals because they get in the way. And honestly, if I don't feel like cleaning my room, honestly, you can just hide your blankets behind your pillows. So. They don't, you don't have to fold them like in the morning. Like when you wake up, you don't have to fold them, just throw them behind your pillow and nobody can see them. I fold in my little blanket because that's not as hard as I, it is. So there's my bed. Hey. And usually I grab my dirty laundry that I have wore today and I just put it in my laundry basket over here. like. Here's a tip, you should get one of these laundry baskets, a big laundry basket and just put it in a corner where you do not use any space. I put it over here to the side over here and um, I just put it over here and I just literally, it's actually easy. I pretend like I'm playing basketball and I just throw it in there. It's fun. So it's not a waste of time and it's actually better just not carrying your laundry downstairs with your bare hands you just carry that down so that is a tip you should try out if you don't have a hamper and then I also wore these I get my my warm and jeans straight I think I, I wore these too um I wore these too too oh. ball is life Okay, then I also have stuff up here, so I'm going to be bending down, and I have my phone. And I'm going to be grabbing the clothes right here, so I'll be right back. So I got everything moved out of the way for the camera. I have a makeup bag, I just left that there. And I cleaned my desk lastly, because that's not on the ground, and I just cleaned my stuff on the ground first. So I have this from Shea Practice, and honestly, I throw this out there because out in the loft because this is does not go in my room. And after I'm finished cleaning my room, I just pick that stuff I threw out there. So I'm just going to pick up these papers. Like I, these are the papers I call I have to follow you guys on Musically, Emilians, and I keep those like in this drawer right here. So next I have um, one of those chair bags. I honestly keep this on in my closet. I hang it up on the wall and it just, it gives me extra room to hang stuff that I don't usually use. So it gives me an idea. So another tip you can have is you, if you guys don't have a drawer and you just throw your stuff in the closet, I really expect to get like, not a high expensive one like this one, but still a three or two drawer that's only like 30 bucks you can find on eBay or something. See, I store all my undies and my socks and then I have my pants and then my shoes because I, I need a room and extra, and I have also pants. So that's very useful for any type of clothing, but not shirts and to hang those up, like pants and then any type of thing you just want to put in there. So yeah, that's very useful too. And then also you can store stuff on top of the dresser, like accessories or like any type of decorative thing you want. And I think that just gives your room a little flair. I'm just going to be cleaning this stuff over here on the floor. So I'll be right back and move. 
So, usually when I'm in bed, I usually do stuff. Oh god, you can't even see me. <laughs> so usually when I'm in bed and I do stuff, I just throw it on the floor. And honestly, that's like the best thing when you're doing something in your bed and you just want to go to bed and you just throw it on the floor. So I expect you guys to have a floor. So yeah, use a floor. It's very useful. So I got all my stuff. Usually I separate the stuff on what it is. This is a paper, so that's trash. Um, I have color pencils and then a pencil. I have hair product and then I have a dirty shirt, which got to go in the ball life. I didn't make it suck. So. And then also I have a journal and so um, I gotta put that with my journals and owl coloring books to go with it. So like also you can like put stuff together that doesn't go together but kind of matches together in a separate drawer. And also these are very useful too, junk drawers and that's where like all my pencils and mechanical pencils go. Um, so like they're pretty much my craft stuff. So you can honestly get any type of drawer that can fit under your bed so no one can see it. Or you can put your personal stuff in it. And I think that's very useful because you can just store stuff in here. Like when you don't even need it, you just put it in there. And I just think that's a very hidden way to keep your personal stuff hidden or any type of junk that you don't want out in your room. And then I also got candy and that just goes in my friend's candy bucket. So I just threw that in there. And then up here, I think I was organized. Hmm. Can't say it. <laughs> so over here, I have a lot of stuff. Um, this came up from one of my shelves. I just put this stuff. And you also can find a little compartment. I found this at Florida, and I thought it was cute because it's just shelves. And so like I store like jewelry in this big shell I found at the beach. Also in there. Oh God. There it goes. <laughs> so I just put that in there. And then also I got a note from a fan and I keep those sometimes. Also, you can find like these type of drawers. Like this is another good tip. Like honestly, you can just find any type of one drawer with a bottom compartment where you can store like books, CDs, trophies. And then like in here, I store like my facial stuff and then my iPhone cases and all that sort of stuff. And it's very useful because you can store a lot of stuff in here and down there. So I think it's very useful too. I'm just gonna put that there for now because I have to go through it tonight. So like, since I have organized all the stuff on the floor, I'm going to be putting it away also. So, there you go. Like one of them is not a junk drawer. I keep my fan mail in there, like, that I like. My mom lets me keep it. It also, when you feel like you don't want to pick something up, just throw it on your bed. Cause like, that's a tip I use every day. Like, when I don't want to clean it, I just throw it on my bed. And after I'm done cleaning the stuff I want to clean, like OCD, I just throw it, like, I pick it up and just put it away. So, a bed is a tip. If you have a bed, use it. So now that I'm going to be picking the stuff up over here. Sorry about the light guys, I need a light. So also here's another tip, like you can do sections of your room, like that side of the room you can finish, and this side of the room you can do, and then finally finish with that. I think that's a very good tip you guys should try because I use it all the time. Like I just pick that side up and like that side's done, I leave it alone and I just pick up the middle. And it's actually a very good tip also. So I have a Dick's hat from Dick's Last Resort. I'm just going to be storing that in my junk drawer because um, I don't need it, but I want to keep it. So I just put that in my junk drawer. Just like under my bed. And this is my hairbrush. I put that on my uh, makeup dress dresser. And then over here is an egg and that goes over there to my so then I have this piece of paper that is trash. We're gonna play ball. Are you guys? Ball is See, that's a fun tip you guys should try. Like, honestly, just play basketball and think every trash and clothes just goes in a basketball hoop. You're having fun playing your room. See, see that stuff? I'm going to be cleaning right now. See the hamper? This 
and dirty. We're gonna play ball. Ball is not if life. Can I have everything? <sighs> so then, another tip is just to die. Okay, I'm back. Sorry, guys. So next, like, if you have clothes or something, and you feel like you don't want to go through it, just literally organize every single clove. So you like cheer stuff. I goes in one pile. Cheer shirts goes in one pile. And if they're unfolded, just fold them. Then I have cheer shorts, and that just goes in the same department as my shirts. And then I got a tank top that hangs up, so you can just leave that there. Cheer shirt. This is a skirt, so it goes with my pants. So I'm going to put that with my pants. Shorts goes in another shirt department. Cheer shirts. Pretty much everything that I get out of the laundry basket, not the dirty laundry basket, the clean laundry basket is cheer. Like, sorry guys, like everything is. Cheer. Cheers, my life. And then if you have this, you just put that in your extra pile, like the stuff that doesn't go close. This is not that's a shirt actually. Shirts. Shirts that need to be hang up goes in one pile. And I got a journal, so that goes like in a different compartment and so does this next day. And then just finally put your clothes in your basket. So now that you have figured in um, figure out organizing your clothes, you're going to put them away. So my jeans go in this apartment, this drawer, this bottom drawer, and this top drawer, my skirts go in half. I don't really have that many skirts, but that's the skirt drawer because it's winter. Well, it was winter, now it's spring. But it's still raining. So now that I just take my chair clothes, since it's just one pile, then I take my tank tops in one hand and then my shorts in one hand. So now I'm in my closet and this is where all my clothes go. I totally am going to give you this tip. I know you're spending money off this tip, but still, this is worth spending your money because this will help you organize your life. Your life, guys. So like literally this is like a six, five drawer that completely fills my life. I honestly have my summer clothes in this drawer. I have my cheer clothes and then my cheer clothes because I have a lot of cheer clothes. And then I have my like little flimsy shorts and then I have my shorts. Like honestly, this helps you like completely relax because you have all your daily clothes that you're going to be wearing in the summer and at cheer practice. So I totally recommend you buying one of these because it will help you like literally organize your clothes. Put this in my drawer. See, it's that simple. You open it, you put it in, and then you close it. You open that. You put it in, you smush it in. Cause I have a lot of cheer clothes that need to go bye bye. And then you try to close it as hard as you can. <clears throat> and if it ever gets too full, you buy another one. You just keep buying and buying guys. It will help you. And then you got your tank tops. And also I have another ship for you guys, I'm sorry. It all costs money, I know, but it will help you, trust me. I'm recommending you buying one of these. So, this thing completes your life. I'll show you guys what it is. So, honestly, this is my tank top hanger. I have no clue what that scarf is doing. So, I hang my tank tops on this because look at it. It has these holes on the back and you just hang your stuff in it. And like, you can hang scarves. Oh, there goes another one. You can hang scarves with like any in these holes. And then also you can buy these clips like these. And then you just put it on the hole and you attach your tank tops to it. And that you can just organize whatever color it is. And I think this is a very useful tip to help you organize your tank tops and scarves if you like to wear scarves and tank tops. Like, honestly, that's like your bay. So now I got my two white tank tops. I'm going to be putting them in my white tank top section. So honestly, I just slip them through the hole like this and then they stay. Like, it's that simple. 
It's a daily life hack, so you just pull it out and you're ready to go. So now that I have finished putting those up, sorry about the camera view, I just have this stuff to go. So this is my daily extra stuff. So this is a journal. Pretty much goes with those journals up there. So that goes on my bed. This can go in my closet because I just put those on like a shelf I have in there. This is jewelry, so I'm gonna put that on my bed because it pretty much goes with hair supplies. This is a daily extra, so I'm going to be putting this in my just I got this stuff, so now I'm gonna put this up. I'm just gonna take this because with me because I have extra hands and I just like to carry a lot of stuff. And so yeah, hold on. So I honestly I just put it there because that's like my cheer area of bags. So I put that there. And then also the shirts that need hangers, I honestly put them on that black cart right there and keep them until I can get hangers and I'm ready to hang them. And then also I have a belt and I, yeah. Honestly, I think this is like the best thing that will ever happen to you because it hangs like everything for you. Cause it hangs everything for you because this is like, a closet door hanger it's like in the back of it it hangs your shoes because like this is the white thing and then you just stick your shoes in it hold on i'll just pick the camera out and then uh, so this is you're going to be your daily life lifesaver because it can hang anything for you so this white thing behind here is like it holds your shoes and like if it's like summer shoes any type of season you can just put them in here if you just need extra room and also up here it hangs like your book bag old book bags um a robe and then also i put my belt up here since i like to lose my belt a lot and i just use that and also i hang my purses here so you can tell and then so yeah and this is where i put my cheer bags like this is a bed that we did not use and i just think it's very useful because it doesn't take up room because this is level out with this and like I just stick stuff up here so it's all Gucci see I just put my clothes here and then also I have this extra clothes and I just literally pick this up and put that there ready to be hanged guys look we're almost done I just got back on over here is a lot of junk that I don't need so going to junk drawer useful don't mind this, this is light by the way. So I have drawers in this desk and I put my makeup wipes in these drawers. Um, so yeah, this is all craft stuff right here. So this goes over there. I just throw it on the floor. Floor is like bay. Cause you just throw it. Um, that's craft paper. I got pencils, they go in my junk drawer. So I just like randomly throw it over there. Because floor just helps you and you just pick it up later. At least it's off something you're cleaning. I got toothpaste and toothbrushes. A bag helps. Just like, honestly, put it in a bag and then you roll it up and you take it downstairs into a sink. This has crayons in it. That's craft. This I'll keep because I don't want to break it. This is a crayon that is craft. I'll keep that right there. Um, this is makeup, so I just keep this, um, I just keep this sitting, like, right here. Like, so you're just gonna open it, use your makeup. Got a hairbrush, I'll show you guys where I put that in a minute. This is like a toothpick thing, like, you take, you clean your teeth or whatever. And I just keep this on my mirror shelf, like, it has a little area. I just keep that there so I can clean my teeth in the morning and then I go downstairs and brush them. This is a little ponytail. I totally recommend this. You can go buy this at the Dollar Tree. This will help you um, organize your hair, ponies, and your little rubber bands and bobby pins. So in the top drawer, I keep my, all my bobby pins. See? And then at the bottom ones, I just keep my rubber bands. Oh, God. My rubber bands and um, big ponytails. And that's a big ponytail dropped it. Clean that later. I got mascara. That goes in my daily makeup box because I use that mascara. So I put that in the... I'm just reorganizing my makeup because some of it was out. So I just put that over there. This I will put on my bed. This goes outside. Like I said, I just... So over here 
Hold on. I always pick this up so I don't have to. So over here, I know it costs money and everything, but you can go to eBay and buy it, and I think it's like the best thing ever. Also, this is like a one, two, three, four, five, six, a six drawer compartment, and it's very useful for anything. Like in here, this goes my hairbrushes. This goes out here, actually. And see, I was talking about this is like my shelf. I'm sitting on my desk. So like that goes there, and then that's just some extra stuff. Hold on. And the movie's over. It has to be organized. Like everything has to be the same way. Like this. Use an XC user. So this is a hairbrush, like powder for hair. That goes in there. And like I just keep extra stuff in here, honestly. Like whatever like I use sometimes, like I got hair bands, bandanas, just headbands. That doesn't close all the way because I have that shelf back there. See, like, it just can hold anything for you. So, I totally recommend this. This is a life hack. See, like, on top, you can just put your perfumes. And then, also, I have a lot of nail polish. And this is. So, that will help you also to organize your nail polish. So, as I said, as I threw all this stuff that goes in my junk drawers, I sit on the floor and I just put it in there and I organize it through whatever it is. So, I think this is. This is my makeup slash, not makeup actual, but like, um, I think, I don't know, but I just like put stuff in it, so this actually goes under this drawer right here. Hold on, guys, I gotta wrap it because it, 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 it bugs me because it has to be like for a pack, so fun. See, I use this for like for photos or whatever, I get it for my birthday. That goes over there on that drawer. So I just put this stuff in here. Pencils goes up here. I got this. This can go up there. This, so this goes in here. This also goes in there. And this also goes in there. And this also goes in the trash can. Let's play it. Let's see if I make it. I don't know where to go. I think it's random on the see back. I still didn't make it. And also, I just like keep them separately out there. I said, y'all, so you don't have to show them, but I like to. It's like, makes like a look under your bed. That's why I thought you can also use these. Well, I forgot about these papers. I have bookmarks, and like I have books under my shelf right there, and I just like stick them in the back. So I use them when I. Hopefully I gave you an idea on how to organize and clean your room and give you some tips on what I personally like and how to organize my room. Um, I don't know, this video was kind of weird filming because like I didn't know where to put the camera and everything but I hopefully, I just hopefully think that you guys will like this video so it can just give you an idea on how to clean your room and stay organized like because that's like part of your life you gotta always stay organized and you'll just you'll just feel good so hopefully you enjoyed my video on how to keep your room clean and organized please hit that big thumbs up button it helps me out a lot and if you're not already subscribed hit that subscribe button up there until i see you guys next time stay beautiful my world